Hi, this is Raya with your weekly weather roundup for April 28th to May 4th. Early this week, a deadly four-day severe outbreak rocked the U.S. with 164 total confirmed tornadoes and at least 39 fatalities over 16 states. An EF4 tornado hit Villania, Arkansas, the widest and longest lived of outbreak lasting for an hour. The second EF4 hit Louisville, Mississippi, carving a 35-mile long path. The same storm system also caused major widespread flooding. Pensacola, Florida received 15.55 inches on Tuesday alone, breaking its all-time calendar day record. Mobile, Alabama saw 11.24 inches the same day. Wednesday, the Mid-Atlantic and Northeast received heavy rain and flooding as well with 4.97 inches falling in Central Park in New York. Chester County, Pennsylvania saw 6.6 inches and Philadelphia received five. Baltimore's heavy rains caused a retaining wall to collapse under at least six cars. Heat, dry air, and wind in Oklahoma set the stage for grass fires in Oklahoma City, Luther, and Noble. The Oklahoma City fire is 75% contained. The Etiwanda fire in Southern California has burned over 2,000 acres and 1,600 homes were evacuated on Wednesday under threat of the fire. It is now 95% contained. The West saw the first heat wave of the year this week and set numerous record high temperatures. Camarillo Airport in California hit 98, and Portland, Oregon hit 90 on Thursday. Friday, heavy rains and snowmelt triggered a landslide in northeastern Afghanistan, which buried a village, causing at least 350 fatalities and leaving thousands more missing. Crews are still working to recover the missing, and the government is working to aid the hundreds of survivors who have been displaced. A third of all homes were buried by the slide. 118 daily records were set this week across the U.S., with 63 high temperature records and 55 low temperature records.